just finished your free ride, I'm guessing? Uh, no, I'm going to go out at 2. Okay. Yeah. And mm -hmm. why do you do the afternoon free uh, ride? Just because it's closer to the time we race. So just kind of race, pre ride when you're going to race time kind of thing. But I was out there yesterday and uh, it's awesome. Yeah. Okay. And why is it awesome? Uh, pretty technical and really muddy and slippery. And um, then there's a bit of climbing and a bit of running. So I think it has a lot of everything. Okay, about how much running? Uh, I don't know. Yesterday I thought there was like three sections I would run, but it'll be, it changes every day, so we'll see tomorrow. But. Okay, how are you feeling right now? I'm excited. Um, not too many nerves, just mostly excitement and eager to get out there and just, it's my last race of the season and it's been a great one, so yeah, I'm just curious to see what I can do. So this has been by far your best season For going sure. into the World Championships. Yeah. Does that change the way you feel about Worlds? Um, yeah, I think there's just more excitement than I've had in years past, or, or a different kind of excitement, I guess you could say, yeah. Do you have any idea how many Worlds you've done at this point? Uh, I think this is my seventh one, okay. of my seventh Elite Women World Championship. My first one was in 2011 in St. Wendell, so, yeah. How has the women's field changed since then? Uh, well, the past couple of years, I think it's been really exciting because there's so many top women that could win or, you know, um, have a really good ride. But this year, I think it'll be super fun to watch. And it's it's changed for me over the years because I've slowly progressed. So it's just a, um, yeah. Okay, well, thanks so much. Yeah, and thank good luck you. tomorrow. Thank you very much. Okay.